Yo, what is going on everybody? It's Juan Solo here with A-Squad Gaming and welcome back to the channel. Thank you all so much for tuning in today for some more Ghost Recon. So in today's video, we're going to be going back to the one and only Ghost Recon Wildlands and doing a live commentary mission here on the channel. And the main reason for that is to celebrate the 6th anniversary of Ghost Recon Wildlands. Yes, that is correct. All the way back on March 17th of 2017, this phenomenal game was released. We've certainly had some ups and downs in the franchise since that day, but I'm really looking forward to going back and playing some Ghost Recon Wildlands here today on the channel for you guys. Also, later on this evening, me and G Money Mozart are actually going to be doing a live stream going back and playing Ghost Recon Wildlands co-op for probably two or three hours. Make sure to stay tuned for that. We're just going to be going in having some fun chilling in the chat with you guys answering questions and stuff like that having a great time but overall that is going to do it for the commentary for me here at the very start of the video i just kind of wanted to bring that to your guys' attention that today is the sixth anniversary of ghost recon wildlands but with that being said if you guys go on to enjoy the video a like rating would be super appreciated also for those of you guys that may be new to the channel make sure to subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you do not miss any of my future uploads also, make sure to comment down below if you guys want to see more videos like this here on the channel. But enough of me talking, guys. Enjoy the video. All right, so today we're going to be doing the Prison Village mission. Um, we got to locate the Warden's computer um, in this big camp. It has been a minute since I played this mission in this game. Um, it's actually been quite some time since I played Ghost Recon Wildlands, so I probably will be a little bit rusty. And... All right, we already got... Couple of guards. I did not even know that they, that they patrolled up this high. Yeah, it's been a minute since I played Ghost Recon Wildlands, but I thought what what better way to kind of celebrate um, the sixth anniversary of Ghost Recon Wildlands? For those of you that may not know, um, Ghost Recon Wildlands came out March seventh, twenty seventeen, six years ago today. My channel was much smaller back then. Um, this this game pretty much kickstarted my channel. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna do a, a live commentary. I'm not exactly sure how this is gonna go, if we're gonna even get caught, who knows, but we're just gonna let it play out. And this is ghost mode, so if I lose a character on this video, we're just gonna roll with it. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. Let's see if I can get up here. Take this guy out, it'll give me a good vantage point over the whole base. Even forgot the controls already. Okay. They got alarms rigged up. So we got alarms. We got a turret. Got another turret base there. Just spotted one with submachine guns. There's actually quite a few people in this base. See a second target. I got a third. I got another. That's five. Yeah, I don't normally. They got alarms uh, rigged up. Great mortars. Jeez, I don't think I've ever actually taken down this base, other than maybe the first playthrough in the campaign. Um, but yeah, that's a lot of people down there. Let's see. Let's see if I can work my way down. I know there's a couple snipers. Maybe take those guys out first. Hopefully not get spotted by anybody else. There's a guy right below me. Yeah. I don't know if he'll hear my shot. That's the problem. Well, we're going to find out. Got a target carrying submachine guns. Tango on the roof. Tango on the roof. Man, the bullet drop in this game is pretty crazy. Somebody saw me. Might have been that guy. 
Enemy marked. Hopefully the whole base doesn't go on alert. I don't know if I was detected or not. I don't think so. I think he said that we got a mortar pit over here somewhere. Yeah. We'll see. I feel like using the stairs is probably not the greatest idea, using like the direct route into the base. I don't even know where the warden's computer is. You would think it would be in one of these buildings up here, probably that it, the headquarters building over there. Top off on ammo. That's got to be the warden's office. If there are any prisoner records, they'll be in there. We need to get inside and see what we can find. That's the guy who could see me. Which one's the warden's office? Obviously, if I had the HUD on, it would be able to tell me, but... got a PC over here. Oh. If there's a record of the prison's inmates, it's here. No time to be choosy. We'll download every document. Download started. Stay alert, people. Download complete. Let's exfil and get the data to Bowman. Hopefully there's something here we can use. All right, now we just got to get out of here. That was actually a little bit easier than I thought it was going to be. But... That was almost too easy, so I feel like we need to kind of work our way across, take out a few more guards, and then we will extract um, on the other side. That's one thing that uh, I... I got eyes and a mounted weapon. Would definitely say that uh, Wildlands got right compared to Breakpoint, um, is just the sprawling bases um, on Wildlands. They're just they're just a lot more diverse. They're a lot more unique. Um, overall, they're just a lot cooler locations. eyes and a mounted weapon. That's definitely a guy I don't really want to mess with if I can avoid it. Really don't want to lose a character in ghost mode right now. 
Escucha, brother. Vamos, brother, haga su trabajo. There's like three or four guards right over here, though. Call me John Wick. I don't know if that was everybody or not. Seems like it. You're free. There might be like one more guy up in that guard tower, maybe. get out though once I take out the power doing that it should open the front gate the rebels that I released are engaging let's go up and check and see if there's a guard here and then we'll roll out that's not good there's a guard there We're just gonna exfil. Rebels seem like they got it under control. Well, that mission was a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. Um, a little bit stealthy. Um, the exfil was a little bit sketch, but coming back to play some Ghost Recon Wildlands in 2023, six years old today. Happy birthday to the game. Hopefully we will hear something in the near future about whatever's coming next for Ghost Recon. Hopefully there is something coming. Uh, for the Ghost Recon franchise. We're about a year, year and a half of pretty much radio silence from the developers. So, who knows? Who knows with that? But that's pretty much going to do it for the video today, guys. If you enjoyed it, you want to see me play some more Ghost Recon Wildlands here on the channel, make sure to drop a like and also subscribe if you are new. Also, make sure to tune in later today. Me and G Money Mozart are actually going to be doing a happy birthday Wildlands live stream probably for like three hours or so in the evening later on tonight. So if you guys uh, want to stay tuned for that later on this evening, make sure to subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you do not miss any of my future uploads. But that is going to do it for now. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.